Okay, we've been receiving um, some immunosuppressant drugs from the pharmacy that we have to administer to patients here in the ICU. And immunosuppressants uh, are kind of like cancer agents in how they're administered. And so pharmacy should send you two of these face seal devices, the face seal needles, and then a um, face seal connector for each drug. They should come together in a yellow bag from pharmacy. What you need to do is grab a regular primary IV tubing set and grab one of these uh, 0.22 micron Paul filters. Go ahead and hook this Paul filter up to your primary IV tubing. Connect a bag of normal saline to your primary tubing and run it through so that your Paul filter and your IV tubing are all connected. Then open up one of these connectors I'm sorry, one of these um, face seal needles and connect your IV tubing into here. Go ahead and run some through until you see it primed. Then once it's primed, you can open up the connector. And the connector fits into here like this and turn it clockwise until it clicks. This is now ready to be connected to the patient. This is the chemo drug and how the chemo drug comes or the immunosuppressant. And you see there's this little flap. You open the flap, it is sterile underneath. You then plug your primary tubing into here. So now you have the tubing prime with normal saline. Your chemo drug is up here in the bag and it's now connected. You can then take this blue cap off and lure lock that in to connect to the patient. Once you have it connected to the patient, pull this blue actuator back and shove the needle into the connector. You can now start your infusion. Go ahead and give your infusion through the amount of time that is on the label or as instructed by pharmacy. Once you're completed with your infusion, you can pull this back, take this off, leaving the connector connected to the patient. Then take your saline flush and connect it to the second face seal um, needle. Make sure that you get your air out. Hook that up to the patient, pull back the blue actuator, insert the needle. You can now administer your flush. Once you've administered your flush and you're complete, pull that back, disconnect, and then disconnect this from the patient. All of these items, the uh, face seal uh, needle, the connector, the IV tubing, and the drug have to be thrown away into the chemotherapy, into the yellow chemotherapy bucket, or sealed in bags and sent to the proper location for disposal. On surgical ICU, we have the yellow um, chemotherapy uh, disposal back behind the charge nurse desk.